Copilot Vision is now native in VS Code. That's awesome, because in the past we had to use an extension like this, but no more. Now you can do it straight from VS Code. Let's go ahead and take a look. With Copilot Vision, you can now have it create alt text for you. So you could simply add an image file. And right here, I could ask it to create alt text for this file that I just added. And right away, in this case, Copilot edits is doing the work and it created for me, saved me a lot of time from typing. And if I want it to be shorter, it modifies it and I'll go ahead and keep it. To learn more about Copilot edits, take a look at this link. If you'd like to get some questions answered regarding the UI of VS Code or anything that you see within your screen, you could use Copilot Vision feature here by going to the Attach option and then going to Screenshot of Window. And that will get a screenshot of your VS Code UI, which you can see right over here when I hover. And now let's say I wanted to ask a question regarding these zeros here. It says no problems, but specifically, what's the difference between these two? I'll ask voice chat. Uh, can you tell me what the difference is between the X and the exclamation point on the lower left-hand corner of the image I just attached? And there you go. Let's say I wanted to generate some HTML that was inspired by a screenshot of this web page here. I can have Copilot Vision examine that screenshot when prompting. Can you go ahead and generate some HTML that reflects the image that I just dropped in and make sure to use the image file ray.png spelled R-E-Y dot P-N-G for the photo on the left hand side and also uh, make sure to copy the layout of that web that web page with the squares on the right hand side and include the headers of github and just for transparency i did prompt it two times second time around just to make it closer to what i wanted so let's see what the result is wow there you go oftentimes when we're about to design a web page we use mock-ups or wireframes and sometimes these wireframes could be handwritten like this. So now that VS Code has Copilot Vision native, let's go ahead and try to get it to recreate some HTML on this dashboard on the upper right hand corner. I'll go ahead and drop a screenshot of that wireframe. Can you go ahead and create some HTML based on the image that I drop specifically on the dashboard on the upper right hand corner of this image and make it look really nice with some good CSS. And let's take a look at the result. And there you go. And that's it. So Copilot Vision is going to keep just getting better. So check out the release notes to see how the updates keep affecting it. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. That helps us out with the algorithm. And I will see you in the next one.